Love. How are you Kiwis doing? <laughs> um, so fabulous. Thanks for asking. All right. Oh, you guys are hot. Uh, Look at you. Oh, man, oh this is stop great. it. You okay. Be hanging out more often. I love this. <laughs> okay. Well, we were just talking about how uh, doing these junkets must be so long and boring. So we were like, <laughs> let's hype these guys up, you know? Yeah. So yes. Let's get into it. Get into right, it. This so, is awesome. Okay. We practiced this in the press room before. Okay. Here we go. Oh, I can't wait. Oh my God. I can't wait. Happening. Yeah. Okay. Go ahead. Okay. We need you for it too. We need you. When I say interview, you say love them. Interview. Love them. Love them. Love them. Interview. <laughs> Okay, that's good. Great. I, I yeah, can that's tell, good. can you tell we rehearsed it as well? I mean, I forgot to rehearse. But yeah. I'm <laughs> we'll forgive you. You're, we'll forgive you're you. a pro, it's fine. Hey guys, thank you so much for spending a few minutes with us. Working here at The Edge, it honestly feels like um, coming to a, like a drama classroom every day and the teachers not arrived in class yet and everyone's just having fun and giggling and having the, the time of our lives here. I imagine working on your sitcom it would it would feel very similar to that and you guys are just having a ball every single day oh it's yeah. truly an absolute blast and i think we have the hardest time with all six of us filming oh together my God. Wait, because we have the hardest time or the, our crew our crew sorry our crew has, our the, hardest crew has the hardest time because they're trying to corral us and we're just like little puppies being like oh my yeah. god i'm with my friends i get to do this cool thing it's trying to like wrangle cats yeah you know you're just like it's not working out like, no we're just loud and happy to see each other yeah we're just excited we're yeah. just so excited yeah. what's also really wonderful is the crew as well mm -hmm. it's pretty much the same crew as season one so it just feels more and more like we're a deeper and deeper more connected family everybody it just it's fun it feels really like we've created a really wonderful work environment where it doesn't feel like work yeah every day is like a family reunion and nobody is like a bad drunk uncle so it's great <laughs> <laughs> It's kind of like our work, except I'm probably the drunk auntie, but like still a fun time, still a fun time. This is really, um, I'm going to try and make this not sound creepy, uh, but Hillary, when I had my first flat, which, what do you call it in An America? Apartment? Like, when you go uh, apartment, apartment, when I had my first apartment, my friend Christina and I had a quote from your movie, Raise Your Voice on our wall, the one, when words fail, music speak, and we thought it was really deep. Um <laughs> So basically, <laughs> honestly, don't get me to name it. Sing one of your songs. I know them all. Get away is my favorite. But what I was wondering was, when you guys go into like a show like this, and it is kind of a flatting scenario, what, or like a housemate scenario, what do you guys like bring from your personal experience into the show when you're living in that environment? Because most of you aren't, you know, most of you got families and stuff now. Those days are behind yeah, us. Yeah, I know. I don't have any razor voice quotes in here, but <laughs> not yet. Um... <laughs> Good. Good. Uh, when I we should be an ensemble performance of a Jericho. When I first moved to Chicago, I lived in a living room and shared it with four other men and I would have to wake up and put my bed away every day because it was a pull-out sofa so it's very similar to Ellen's situation of just like living out in the living room having all your shit everywhere for everyone to see so I try to bring that in with me when I am flatten it up with Charlie yeah. Nice. yeah. I mean, you guys do rotate beds. We do rotate beds. That is so dark. I know. It's so <laughs> really dark. It's really, really dark. I don't know what I bring with. I mean, Sophie's a photographer, so I feel like that's a good, uh, like, calming window into, like, her, the way her brain functions and the way that she sees things is, you know, that. But, um, but honestly, a quote from Raise Your Voice would be stronger. <laughs> For me, I, I mean, I, I definitely girl. remember my first apartment had, yeah, like my room was in this lofted space, a ladder that had all my pots and pans. I would lower and it would come down and I'd crawl up into this crawl space where I would sleep. And all my friends, the girl I was dating at the time, shared a bed, shared a bed with like two other girls because they couldn't have enough space. I mean, it was, that's what New York living is. It is that like just being on top of each other, but that's, that's also what is part of what makes it so fun. And in, in your 20s, I feel like when you first move there, it's, it's, it's effortless because everybody's living that way. I think what's fun about meeting our characters now is that now we're in our 30s, but still living like this. And we have so much square footage. And, and it's, no, yeah, we, we, have, we, have, we have an insane have, have amount so of square, square footage. footage yeah. yeah, but I think the idea- Especially when you've got, 
when you got kids at home too, where you can just like pretend you're 20 again, that must be the dream. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That yeah, would be that's my dream. That's the highlight of that my nice. job. Yeah, I yeah. come here, like I had a child <laughs> at like 24, so I've been responsible for such a long time. I get to come here and act like I have none of those responsibilities. That's pretty cool. And it is, it is pretty cool. Sometimes we drink it's wine on set, you know? Yeah, we're, we're having bad, fun. We like the bad kids in the, like, in the back of school smoking cigarettes. Yes. This is a great idea that we could maybe implement for our yeah, show. You could maybe, yes, implement maybe implement it. Implement. Yeah. Might be doing kids. that yeah. from time yeah. to time. <laughs> <laughs> my kids are listening to this. <laughs> Amazing. Hey, guys, um, how proud are you? Because this show is, you know, it's 2023. We are... We're in this diverse world and, and how cool to see a show really reflecting that with sexual orientation and gender and people of color, which I, I so love. So is that something that you guys are super proud of as well? I think we're proud and we just want to go deeper. Yeah. Like we're just ready to have more storylines mm -hmm. that that make that a part of our world. Mm -hmm. And, um, you know, it's so funny. I was just like talking to my son the other day and he just has no, he's like 11 mm -hmm. and like the, the, the way that they talk to kids at schools have changed and it's just so lovely. So the ones that are like holding us back are like the people our age or older, you know, and it's like, we're done. We're, we're moving past that. And it, it's cool to be part of a show that, um, is it full of forefront. just straight white people? Yeah, yeah it's nice. Yeah. It just is like there's yeah. a lot more fun dynamics and stories to be yeah. told. And like, and we just want to go deeper. Yeah, I love that. I yeah. love that. Yeah. <laughs> Totally. Yeah. Well, congratulations on, on a great show. Season two, it's out now. Every Tuesday, a brand new ep comes out. Um, thank you for giving up your time. Hillary, a big thanks, especially to you for um, providing the soundtrack for our New Zealand summer, especially in the North Island. It's been raining every single day. Oh yeah. So we've been blasting clean back to back oh to back. Oh my gosh. Like... <laughs> you guys are so great. So good. Nice but... to meet you. Thank you thank so you, much. Guys, this has been a bucket list interview. It's getting a tick. Whoa, we got Whoa. the tick. And, um, Woo! If you guys come to New Zealand, um, we will uh, take you yeah. out. Or you can avoid us because, you know, so, uh, that's been done before as well. Just avoid her. I'm I'm way more chill. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Bye, guys. Bye. See you later, guys. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. Bye.